All right, had some recording difficulty. Um, here we are in 18th. I screwed up qualifying. Thought I could get away with race fuel because I was not getting any traction on Q fuel. So we're starting way in the back, and uh, I just hope I can survive. Uh, 22 cars, two splits, 100 laps at Bristol. If there's a wreck, we're going to see it. I hope I'm not broadcasting the rest of this race. But let's see. About to get going. I hope everyone's got a good handle on the car. And uh, yeah, we might be a chicken streaker. Inside line had a tar hard time getting going there. Oh, that's what I want to hear. Up, up top three wide. Clear that row. We got one in the wall. Nine car and the 18 getting together on the straightaway. I think someone just gunned the gas a little too hard. 20 cars making moves up underneath the 18. 18's probably got a little damage, so we're going to try to sneak around him as he holds the top line. Everyone's just being easy on the start. Alright, got away with missing that one. And that kind of looked like Ryan's car. Yes, it was. That sucks. I'll have to Get see what happened 18. to him. Uh, we are up into 14th, it appears. But uh, it sucks to see someone go out that early. Especially someone that can contend for wins. Um, yeah, no idea. Hard to see what happened because we were still in the turn. Um, let's see if anyone else up at the top. Well, Stanton's already up to third. AJ has dropped to eighth. So kind of uh, back and forth up there. 18's going into the pits, I think, to get damage repaired. So that's going to move us into 13th for this restart, and now it's not looking as bad for me. So, as long as I didn't get, like, some phantom damage that I didn't know about, because we definitely didn't get an axe there. But, yeah, it's, uh, it's Bristol. This is completely expected. Gonna have cautions. Gonna have people running into each other. Uh, especially when you're doing 13 second laps. If it was cloudy out, we'd be down in the 13 fours. Luckily, it's uh, sunny out. That's going to slow us down to 13 eights to 14 O's. And the track temp's going to stay hot no matter how many times a cloud comes over. But going to be doing a lot of caution talking, so. One left to green. Looks like the 18 is parked it as well. That's three, unfortunate. One, get ready, going green. This is going to be a weird one with single file restarts. I don't think we've, yeah, we didn't do one at Phoenix, so. This is the first time, and I think it's going to take a while for the back of the pack to get going because you're not going to be able to see the leader. So the first indication we're going to get is when the green lights go, I think, because even looking left, I can't see it. There we go. See people going. What the slow car call was about. Got someone coming out of the pits to see 18. He was in the pits for a long time. Alright, so I'm at Wayjacker 5 right now. Definitely going to adjust on that. Got the 21 car. He was fast in practice all day long. Um, 
not sure if he's got damage or why he's being a little slow. He could just be looser right now. He's waiting for it to come in at the end of the race. Definitely here using a lot more weight backer changes just to get through the first part. Right now I'm just sitting, waiting. I'm going to be better off at the end of this one. I hope, because I went with a little more stagger than what default is. Get in there. Try to get him to back off. Okay. Gonna be doing some slide job type moves to get around people. Got that cleared, and that's gonna put us up into 12th. So, now just kinda slowly work my way back up, up to the 20. The 21 has issues behind. I think he might have got into someone there. Hopefully not. Car's starting to feel better now. This higher temp and the stagger is going to take a little longer to come in than what I was practicing for, so we're rolling now. Just got to find a way around the 20 as he sits in the middle of the track, which is fine. I don't want to see lap cars do that, but... Now he's looking at his mirror and having issues off the corner. Just focus on your line. Point two, four, one. Right. Looks like he's got going. Gather it back up, get another run at him. Passing here is difficult in any car very much so in this car. Wow, his middle of corner speed is way down. Oh, no, shit. That was close. I thought I was dead. I thought I was in the wall. This thing attaches itself to the wall as well. Alright, he backed off. He was nice to me. He didn't have to be. He could have raced for it, but um, yeah, it's dangerous to be side by side through any part of this track. It's getting tight again. We're going to go down to zero on the weight tracker. Looks like AJ is either getting past or working the bottom. I think he is getting past. Looks like the Alpine car is on his outside now. So they've got a little group of cars just all by themselves. They're not going that quick. Derek ahead is putting in some good laps. It's just a little quicker than me, I think. And I assume the leaders are probably getting the lap traffic already. This car has tightened up very quickly, and I'm at zero on the weight jacker already. So I hope the bottom split is doing good, having a fun race. AJ backs off and just gets behind the pack. You're going to have people who are set up a little tighter. Ooh, the Alpine car gets into the wall. I don't know if he got help getting into the wall by Gavin, or if they... Uh, both went up there and hit the wall, but that could be some right side damage for both of them. It's just so tight off the corners here. Oh, AJ up into the wall. Alright, so... Definitely lap traffic coming up. Because I don't think we're catching the leaders. Unless they're stuck behind lap traffic. And now, I think everyone is just trying to, like, cycle under the 14. 
and can't get the pass made and then they get cycled back. I think that's what's happening here. I think the 14 is just able to hold on to that spot right now and uh, no one can get around it. Because maybe that's what AJ was doing and then he got cycled back and then nearly happened to the seven. Yeah, I'm not going to let you in, AJ. Almost the pass done by the seven. Oh, AJ, look ahead, buddy. Alright, that's a lot of front end damage on the seven car. Oh, that's Gavin. The one car is Ryan. I was thinking the black car was a number seven as well. I'm an idiot. That obviously is not a thing. So, that has not worked out for anyone trying to get around the Alpine 14. That's a weird thing to say. Let's see if we can make a pass on the bottom. Loosen it up down here. Try. Fuck, it is so hard to make a pass. I do not want to wreck. Alright, we're going to hang out for a bit. Let the tires burn off. So, is Gavin's front end back? No. He's going back down to the bottom. The rest of the field's catching us now. And it's nothing that the 14's doing wrong. He's just running his line. Everyone's just struggling to get around him. But loosening it up on the bottom was not the answer. Because I almost did exactly what Gavin did. He might have gotten to the back of the nine. We are ticking laps off, I bet. Yeah, lap 40 already. AJ's on the wall, maybe. And here comes Joe flying up from the back. It's just a traffic jam here. Like, look how Ryan just shot away. But 14 has every right to race. You know, he doesn't have to let the people go. He's on the lead lap. It's just, you got to make that pass down low. And it is proving to be a difficult one. AJ's starting to make it work. Trying to find some ways around. AJ got a little loose there. We're in three different lines. AJ's getting a little too low. Alpine car in the wall almost. <laughs> this is like just cycling through over and over and over. Almost got into it with AJ. I think I turned down a little bit there and scared him. Nine car trying to make it work. I'm going to. St oh fuck! I fucked that up. That was all me. I got like a little loose and a little stupid correction. Luckily, I didn't eat the wall. I scared the hell out of AJ. He lost a lot out of that. And unfortunately, I was going to have a chance to go after the 14 next. And now I am behind Joe and may have some damage. So the 14 is falling off. I can tell I'm already screwed tighter because I can see smoke in the mirror coming off my right front. Uh, so I think my race is pretty much screwed because in about 30 laps, that right front is going to be just melted. Unless everyone is doing it and it's just not showing up. But I do not remember having that much smoke in any practice. Hey, Jay. That's a wall. 
Well, the Nebens are being absolutely junk and hitting the wall. Oh, Gavin, where are you going? Inside, 14.726. Stay high to the car on the low side. Clear. Hey, this is hard racing, and we have only had that early caution, which is amazing. All right, Scare Joe, come down low, get a run off the corner, and we are going to throw this thing in. Nope, that didn't work. <laughs> I figured, let's try it. I wanted to see if I could, like, slide job him, but all it did was get tight. The 14 is causing some... Oh, he's up in the wall. We're three wide. I think we're still... Are we? I have no idea what's going on. How we all haven't died yet, I have no idea. Okay, I'm sliding up. I have cleared that. Gavin's still stuck. He nearly got that. Holy crap. That was a struggle. I believe there's going to be a wreck there. It's just, it's shaping up to be a wreck. How it wasn't a wreck the multiple times that we screwed up around each other, no idea. My right front is jumped, though. I'm hoping I can take this time now to ease it off. Everyone else is still having issues. Getting around him. Joe's trying to make it work. Actually, yeah. Joe's just stuck there, and they are just traffic jammed now. AJ's looking to the high side. That's never going to work. Don't stick your nose up there. Like, there's maybe a lane that opens up, but I hope he doesn't try to do it. I know he's thinking it. He's He is that aggressive of a driver. He's thinking it. <laughs> you can just see it. That light bulbs went off. Oh, Alpine car in the wall. That slows the top side down. Nope. The 10 car had issues. Couldn't get around him. Oh my god, AJ, don't do it. You crazy bastard. Oh no, no, no. Oh god, AJ. <laughs> oh, AJ. Oh. You have VR. You can look ahead. Oh my god, my right front has got to be just absolutely blistered, dead hot. Um, what a freaking race! My god, that little jam up was ridiculously hard. Like, that was one of the toughest passes I've had to make. So, lap car-wise, everyone up to 16th is a lap down. Stanton's got the lead. 14's got some damage. I think AJ's got some damage. We've definitely used up the bodywork back here. I'm probably sure I have right front damage. I, I'm sitting there looking. I think AJ was really thinking about trying to go to the high side of him. Or he was just running up that high, not even thinking about passing, but trying to get a run. But I don't know. It's just it's such a difficult pass to make around that guy. He was doing good, not making many mistakes. I mean, I've only seen three people pass him now, so... I think he was starting to get hot. I'm coming down here to get some cool, cool pavement. But wow, um, you know what? That was like a 60 lap run, so that's not bad. 
not disappointed in that. I thought this was going to be a bigger mess than what we got. So, you know, there was some issues, but once again, Silver Crown proves to be really good racing. Didn't think he was going to see me. All right, so we are in eighth. The passes are only going to get harder to make here. I uh, just cannot get that 14 in front of me. So weight jacker, I've went back to zero. Um, might be a little loose. I'm hoping the right front's had some time to cool down. And then we've got 30 to go, essentially. One left to green. Great racing, though. I love this car. I mean, we've got so many new people running this right now, and we were still able to have some good racing like that. I think what it does is it's just... An idiot will get in it and go, Oh, this is too, too hard or no fun. And so we just don't get those people showing up here. But let's get back to racing. The pace car is in. Green, green, green. Leader very late on that start. 40.849. Everyone being easy. Thirteen went to the bottom. Not sure if that was the 14, right 14, idea. 5, 5. Looks like he's going to be the caboose very soon. Inside. Still inside. 14. Oh, cars up in the wall. Or prediction code. Now I got to think about. Oh. AJ, I think, just got into the 14. AJ might be getting frustrated. Uh, AJ might be pulling it to the pits. He just went to the back. We got a couple of guys getting loose on the gas. He's going to open the outside up for me. Can't make it there. Eight car is going to go be the caboose now. 14.733 car inside, stay high. Still there at the bottom. Clear. A little loose. 14.683. That puts me sixth. Inside, clear. Had to just 14, nope 14, out of that one. Oh, six car really slowed down there. 14, I'm gonna go 14, middle. Because I gotta protect this spot and get around. Oh shit, he slowed down so much there. Had to go. The hole was there. Ow. And he just came up. <sighs> well, that was bullshit. Thanks a lot. There was no reason he should have come up there. And my race is over. Catch car. car is undrivable now. Well, that's annoying. He kept trying to close that off when I got up there, and you got to pick a lane. So, we're going to watch the end of this one. You entered a closed pit, okay. Got to go to the end of like, the I'm just line. trying to let one guy go. I'm not trying to check up the whole line, and I'm not trying to let the whole line. Oh, that.
that's disappointing. That that makes me angry. Let's find a good place to sit. If I was going to get wrecked, I want it to be after I've... or before I come through the field and feel like I'm going to have a good finish. While they're under caution, we'll go watch and see if I am wrong in what I think happened, but... He just... He was going low to make the pass, and then he just kept coming up to try to close the door. So. We go high. We're on the outside. There's no room for him to come up. And he just turns up there. Like, he just turned right. I don't... I don't know what that was. Just... A very, very stupid move, but... Yeah. Don't know. But, we're broke, so... Now we get a watch. Do not understand why he turned right there. If you lose it, you don't. It doesn't go that direction. So, I'm pretty sure he was clearly trying to uh, just come up and fill that hole that was not going to be there. And maybe there was contact between him and the other guy. No idea, but. Oh well, it's just how this day has gone. So, we'll see if Ryan can get that done. Then we got other Ryan. And then Connor, Derek, Joe, Kevin, Gavin, Lee, and Matt in the Alpine. And AJ's still out there. Car is off. There's just no point in me trying to green, drive green, that green. car. It was so broke. So, battle for where I should be. Joe having a pretty good run in the 10. And that is Kevin. He's, he's having a bad run since the uh, restart at lap 67. He just went down to the bottom, lost tons of spots there, then got up into the wall. And the nine car not making any use of the position that he threw a block for. Sorry, I'm just going to be pissed at you for the rest of the race. Just We're done. Get going. don't let it get to you. Just uh, never happy to get wrecked out no matter what. But he is completely dropped off. Um... Only three cars without damage are the front three. And we are 10 to go. So we will watch Ryan and Ryan and see what happens. Gavin going for the pass now. Hooked over the uh, transition there. I 
All right, you got him cleared. Ah, oh, you should have slid up. Take it away from him. Oh, you... what'd you turn down for? I don't know if he got loose there. You got to, when you're clear, slide up in front of him, middle of the corner. Only way to do that. Joe back to the bottom, trying to uh, get back up next to the nine. AJ's working his way back here. We got lap traffic going down to the apron. Very good getting out of the way there by the 11. I think Gavin was a little bit scared of how that was going to work. Lost some ground. AJ working the very top top. Back up front, nothing has changed. So this is the race and the wreck. And there it is. And everyone behind freaks out and piles in. And we get a big one. Leaders coming around trying to figure out where to go. They get around it. I think AJ got through that. I mean, his, his car is junked, but... Uh, we're doing a green-white checkered now. So, uh, pretty clear Jeffrey's going to win. Sorry to the two Ryans, but you you guys don't have a shot at this. Um, then, looks like the six is going to definitely finish fourth. Uh, Gavin got that fifth spot, so happy to see that. And then we will see... How 6th and 7th and 8th all shape up. I assume AJ is going to try a very uh, aggressive move to the outside. Try to sneak out there. Unfortunately, he races in VR, so I can't tell him to do everything possible to pass that guy to make me feel better. And, all right, AJ has internet issues. May have just done a pit road violation. And his race is over. <laughs> well. I guess any time one of us gets to the back of the nine, we die. At least his was internet issues or computer issues. He is trying to run VR on a computer that can barely handle it, so. So we got the 15 who should be getting the wave around here to get out of the way of the leaders. If not, then a weird situation can happen. So we'll see if it handles it correctly. But he shouldn't be there to begin with, because if the yellow came out, the leader's in the lead. Gets the wave around. Let's see how this goes. Are kind of hanging back, but you really can't get a run with this I new gearing. You can't job. really jump it. Green, green, green. No, he does. 
but he can't really yeah, go PBR. anywhere PBR. with it, so he goes to the inside. Is he going to get past? No. I think Ryan's going to be able to hold this one off. White flag, not going to be a caution. No. Well, he just threw away a couple of spots. But holds on to fifth place. Good job, Gavin, getting back up to fourth. And uh, yeah, the flag. let's take a look it's at over. the final results. Okay, we'll get them next time. Um, so we've got Stanton, Carwile, Sellers, Lemon, Mabel, Love, Coons, uh, Joe LaFilth. Is that LaFilth? I that's too hard for me to say. I just called you LaFilth, so that's your new name, LaFilth. Uh, Kevin DeBello, Lee finishes 10th, Andrea, and Samu. And then the rest of us wrecked and crashed and broken and yeah. Sorry, Bryce, I will talk to you eventually, but right now I am trying to end this video. Let's go look at what happened on that first one because I am interested to see how Steel ended up wrecked. He's hauling ass right now, and he's by himself, and oh no, the wall. Wall grabbed him, oh, and he gets AJ. Alright, well, at least it was his own fault. I was worried that someone had gotten into him. Unfortunately, he had gotten into himself. And then, let's see back here. I forgot what this wreck even was. I'm going to assume, was it somewhere here? Yeah, it was, wasn't it? No, it wasn't. Oh, yeah. They drove through this guy. Oh, the 11 car. Uh, both of these guys are racing each other at this point, And he just went in and got him. I know Jim didn't mean to do that. The 11 did what he was supposed to do. Held his brakes. AJ catches him going through. AJ, how'd you... All right, I gotta see this. Oh my god, that was a massive, horrible push. See the smoke, you see the car. Oh, he just, you weren't looking forward. You were looking at the tank of the 14. No way you should have hit that guy. Terrible. And then, unfortunately, my issue ended up causing a big mess. I don't, I don't understand what that was. I unfortunately got into the 13, but then we also got the 8, who had nowhere to go. And then everyone behind is seeing that. AJ's looking three wide middle. He doesn't do anything there. 16 gets into the wall. The 20 freaks out and turns left. Here I am. I'm still just trying to get the hell out of the way. I go down low, and Jim, 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 four wide is not the solution at Bristol. I know, everyone's checking out. Don't, don't take any of this personally. Um, yeah, that was just the situation. The 19, I think the 19 thought I was going to stay on track, and he checked up a bunch. The 15 went up top higher than he was ready for and had to check up to not hit the wall. And Jim wasn't ready for any of that. And then got the 15, which then got a couple of people. So, none your fault, but um, 
it's racing. It's Bristol. So I'm going to be annoyed and move on to the next race. I hope to see everyone show up to the next race. This is going to be one of the toughest races we get. Uh, Martinsville is going to suck too. But uh, don't be scared. Show up. Even if you show up and wreck and end up at the end of this, don't worry about it. It's racing. Everyone's new. That's why we're doing this on a uh, different um, time slot than what everyone else runs, just to not make anyone mad. So thanks for everyone that showed up. And uh, yeah, new UI, I don't have that up. I will uh, take a look at the other um, results later on. But hope you all enjoyed it. Hope the second split had a good race. And thanks for watching.